plaintiff, Ebony Noakes Jones, met the defendant in elementary school, where they eventually went their separate ways because the defendant is wild. Ebony claims the defendant drank, did drugs, and worked as a stripper. And Ebony's suing because she claims the defendant's out-of-control children damaged her property. Defendant Lanisha Sanders Rainey says Ebony has some nerve talking about her lifestyle considering they used to do drugs together. Lanisha also claims that Ebony's children are the wild ones and they are the ones who damaged Ebony's property. All right, start with you. Well, I would like to start off by saying me and Lanisha has been friends for a long time. We were friends in elementary. We kind of grew apart because she was always wild and reckless. And we came back across each other some years down the line. I tried to give her another chance as far as thinking that we was grown and we can handle this. But yet and still, she still was acting ratchet, spiraling out of control. She had became a stripper. She was drinking and drugging. So make a long story short, we came back across each other a few, you know, a few years after that. And last year we hung around each other or whatnot. And she came back into my life with the same reckless things, but you know, I still tried to help her as a friend. She had lost custody of her children. Mm -hmm. And this was the second time around, once we came back around, she had lost, she had got her children back, then she had lost custody again. So I was just trying to be supportive and help her out, giving her rise to work and everything like when that. When was this, that she came back into your life like um, this when you helped? What month and year, or season and year? I would say like November of 2014. Okay. Mm hmm So you were helping her out, and how did that go? It was okay, but it was still a, a little bit overwhelming due to the fact that she's still so wild and crazy, and <laughs> her kids are wild and crazy, and it's always some drama with her. So Let we start... from her, then. You give me some background. First off, Your Honor, my kids... Our kids are kids. Her kids are also wild and crazy, and she also into drugs and everything like I was, so it ain't like I was by myself. And far as helping me, with what? I don't know. She didn't give you um, rise to work? Did she give me rise to work? Yes, ma'am. I gave her, yeah, she gave me a few rise okay, to work. And I also way of gave helping you. How else did you help her? Um, I gave her rice to work. I took her to the grocery store. Did she take you to the grocery store? I also took her to the grocery store, too, and gave her rice to work, too. All right, so you had a car. Yes, sir. So what did you need to her to take you to work We were for? carpooling. We were working at the same place, actually. Okay, is that true? Both of no. you had cars? Um, she had a car, but it broke down. And that then, every, when it was breaking down, I was her everyday ride. Okay. Just like when her car broke down, I was taking her so back to school. So car broke down, break down also? My car never broke down. It was just that we worked Lie. at the same place. And well, she that's was, what she's saying. You're acting like you did a lot for her, and all you did was give rides back and forth like she gave you ride back and forth. Mm -hmm. You just said that, and now you're saying it. She helped me with a job. I helped her with a job. I mean, it... Everything you did for her, ma'am, she says she did for you. And you say her children are... Just as wild as two. Just as wild as mine's two. Mm -hmm. right. It ain't no sugar coat, nothing. Her kids as wild as my kids. They're actually a little wilder than mine. How old wow, are your children? really? My children are wow. 13, what 12, range? 13, 12, mm -hmm. 10, 4, and 2. Okay. And how old are your children, ma'am? My daughter is 13, 11... 10 and 8. All right, so one, two, three, four of them, well, at least three of them are right around the same age, if not the same age. Correct. Yes. What are you suing for? I guess that has something to do with the damaged property, obviously. Correct. The children. What happened? What are you telling me? Um, first of all, I'm suing for my car. Her son jumped out my top story window onto my minivan and wow. left a big old dent in the top of my car. Her son was the one that actually Quiet, jumped out the window. I'll let you speak when she's finished. What do you mean, jumped out of the second story? <laughs> yeah, like I got a house. You know how you had the loft rooms upstairs? Mm -hmm. That's yeah. my upper story, so it's like one huge room. He jumped out of the window? He jumped, tore, tore the screen off and jumped out of the window. <sighs> Who told um, you this? Everybody said it. All the kids said he even said it himself. Your Honor, she wasn't Let her there. Finish, man. He even said it himself. He... When you spoke to her about it, what did she say? She was right there. She was beating on her kids. She was calling them all type of ratchet bees and regarding, regarding the car, I'm talking about that specifically. Yeah. yeah what when... happened when her son jumped onto the uh, hood of your car? 
he jumped on it. See, see, we was at work, okay? Let me start from that. That, that beginning of the day, she had called me because we was working together, right? She had called me and she was crying, talking about her baby daddy had beat up on her and wouldn't watch the kids. So me being the friend that I am, I told her that it was okay because I didn't want to miss work and I didn't want her to miss work, you know? I was and, the driver. And yes, she was the driver Go that ahead, day. tell me about that. Okay, and um, then... I let her kids come in my home. By the time we get off work, by 2, 30, 3 o'clock, it's police cars in front of my house. Totally different case. Her door, her, it's police cars in front of my house, two state police boys out in front of my house, and then her daughter was in handcuffs. She had physically assaulted another neighborhood kid that, that right she don't even know. Right along with daughter and her friend. You know, that's just how they are. She don't whip the girl with a belt and just, the police said that she had beat the girl so bad with her fist that that's why they was taking her down because she used her fist as a weapon. Girl, Girl, be you real. Know? Your daughter jumped in, too. And this when they too. be quiet, ma'am. And this when they were staying with you at your place? Yes, yeah, this was in that right. day. But it wasn't the same incident? Yeah, no. it was the same incident. No. It was the same incident. No. It was certainly the same day, though. Yes, no. the same right. day. And we, Quiet, ma'am. Approximately what day? Or do you have any type I of report? I don't know exactly what day that was, but it had to be... Um, you didn't get a police report? No. No, because it was for her daughter. Okay, but wasn't she at your house? Yes, yeah, she was at my house. What's your paperwork there for? Yes. What these, is that for? These are my estimates and the pictures of the damages done to the things. To the car? To the car, my bed, and my TV. Tell me what happened to your bed and your television. Um, the the bunk bed was perfectly fine. Her uh -huh. son, the one she that jumped out of... don't even have bunk beds. The... You say she doesn't have no. bunk bed? No, Hold she on. don't. And never well, came we got to me and told to me anything it. about any bunk beds. You've been in her Been her in bedrooms. her house. Yes, been in her house. Yes, I've been in her house numerous of times. Okay, and, and you say you do. We can get rid of this easy. You say you have pictures of a bunk bed? Yes. You want all this at once? I just want to see the bunk bed. We got a very well, central he... lie here. Either you lying about having them or she lying about you oh. not having them. Well, I've never seen no bunk beds. I've seen I know, two and you say you go in and out all and, the yeah, time. I my point exactly, and there was no bunk beds and I never understand. came to me and told me anything about our bunk beds. Did you so say she don't have that's one, a lie. period? Okay. That's, that's I didn't see lie. no bunk beds when I went in there. Right, okay. i seen two twin beds. Lying is one of her diseases. All right. Yep, yours too. Sure that. Yours too. Mm -hmm. oh, no. What that look like? Bunk beds. Never seen those. Okay. No, uh-huh. And the car, how do I know that what you're saying is true regarding the car? Do you have any type of statement from anyone? My children, I didn't get no statement okay. from my own children. And her my children was jumping there and her How many kids honor. were there? All my four children mm -hmm. and all of her kids except for her own. And all of them said that her or son even did her it. own son Actually, said uh -huh. he did it. And like she's going to tell me no. So of course. you tell me what happened. First off, Your Honor, mm -hmm. When the incident happened, mm -hmm. about bunk beds, never once have she came to me and told me anything about no bunk beds. I know, you said she didn't have Second any. Of You've all, been in there all this, the time correct. and she didn't have any, This right. car she talking about, mm -hmm. her son jumps out of the two-story window. My son didn't jump out Who her two-story window. We seen, we was there when he was jumping out the window. <laughs> first, okay. and then her what car, first when, her no, car. No, no, no. When he jumped, let's stay there. When you all were there and you saw him jumping out of the window. It's not my son. She didn't say I, anything I to him. I didn't ask you that. <laughs> Listen to what I'm saying. When you all were there and you were watching her son jump out of the window, he, you saw him jump onto the car? No, I didn't see him jump on the car. Where'd you see him jump out of the he window just... too? Where did he jump ground. out to? On the ground? Yes, sir. All right, from two stories up? The window huh. is not even, when you, if you was to see this house, uh -huh. the window not even that far up. Okay, nobody did anything? They just sat there and watched him? <laughs> yeah, I did, because it ain't my responsibility. Oh, I didn't ask you whether it is your responsibility. And you're talking in a way that a guilty person talks. No. That's a, yes, you are. You're sounding like a guilty person. No, I ain't. No, I You already lied about the bunk bed. I believe everything she's saying about you and your children. Therefore, I'm going to grant you a judgment. $1,300 based on this evidence here that she clearly is not being honest about. Everything else you're saying, I believe, based on her character and the way she's discussing things today. Mm. Have a good day. Judgment for the plaintiff. Thank you, sir. You know, my kids did not do
Or your bed. Or, Girl, or, come on. You or know Or your it. car. You or just ratchet. Car. It's okay. Just like you. It, no, never. Just like you. Never, boo. Just like That's why you, you wanted to be around just me like trying to take you. some pointers just on how to like be a real you. woman and a real Girl, mother. a real who, mother. What type of woman? What type of force? Even what if type it was my child or not, who would let a child jump out of a window and just not do nothing about it?